Yeah, that was crazy. I was like, I can't believe this this guy has <sighs> boobs now. And I and I tagged him on Savannah's Instagram. I was like, oh my god, Queen of More. <laughs> Like You're famous person. now. Like I never met, I never met them, but I, I think I tried to book mm -hmm. them on a comedy at Stonewall show because I'm like I would have drag queens on sometimes, mm -hmm. and uh, and then he wrote back like, "Can you believe this, Savannah Hernandez? Uh, she is holding space for hate." And I was like, "What? This phrase of like holding space? It's like uh, plus like how is she? Okay, first of all, Savannah Hernandez is great. I like her. She's a friend of mine, but also she's not holding space for anything. She's like. I'm videotaping. I'm taping this. Like yeah. I'm not Just videotaping. Being a journalist. I'm aging myself. But like she records <laughs> it and then she shows it. Like that's not she records. Like these are people doing the things that these people do. Are there only some people who are allowed to record you doing the things you do in public? Why? What's that about? It doesn't make any sense. She's obviously not uh, you know, or she recently got banned from Twitter again, which has happened I think this is the third time now. Um, and the first time she was banned was for ban evasion, but she had only ever had one account and she tried to appeal it and it didn't work. So she made a new account. So her latest ban came after a video she did went viral. It was a compilation of interviews she did at Pride where she was just asking people about their identities and people were openly talking to her about it. Honestly, like she didn't say anything mean to anybody, nothing. She nope. recorded people speaking about their identities with pride, at pride. And somehow this was hateful, showing people saying what they believe about themselves uh, and they're happy about it. Like why is, there's nothing wrong with, if you believe that there's nothing wrong with them or what they're saying, then there can't be anything hateful in showing it. It was nothing crazy at all. Yeah, like this, this is, video, yeah. Yeah, this was it. I'm gay. <laughs> what age did you know that you were gay? Um. I think at like 10, I knew that I, I think at 10, but I wasn't like, I wasn't clear on my gender. Yeah, I I think it, it was around like 10 as well when I, st I started questioning if I was bi. And then since then it was kind of like a, a slippery slope because I kept, I was like, am I bi, omni, lesbian? And then I, I kind of like came to the point and on the now recently I've been like, am I pan? But then I like, I think... Now I'm starting to realize that I'm queer, but yeah, it was, it started around 10. It wasn't like fully formed, but I guess like, that's when I realized. Wait, that's a possibility? Yeah. I am genderqueer, trans mask, and queer. What's trans mask? Trans mask is like people under the non-binary umbrella at identifying like, or presenting mask. Masculine? Yeah. What about you? Um, I'm trans and uh, on my sexuality is unlabeled. Um, I, I use he him pronouns. Yeah, yeah, and I use they pronouns. Tell us what you guys identify as. We're asking everyone here gay today. Fuck, gay, gay, cis, uh, what is it? Cisgender male. There we go. I don't know. Gender. Gender neutral or gender fluid. I think that's what they said. I don't know. I'm confused. Do you identify as gender fluid? I don't know. She, her, it. I feel like, honestly, honestly, it should not be a bad pain. Like, I've talked to people who go with they and them. I'm like, well, in the grammar of things, how would you want to represent yourself? Like, what is so bad about what she's doing? She's just asking Nothing. people questions. And it's real. It's actually super interesting in a very non-judgmental way it's very interesting to hear what people think about themselves how they view themselves and how they're positioning themselves in broader society within also the community of pride i find it fascinating like i could watch savannah interview these people all day um and just hear what they have to say about themselves she has My a nice way is yeah she has a really okay. good way about her like and i've seen savannah be combative and be more like if she's very passionate about a point like she's a she can argue well and she can debate pretty well and uh but she was very neutral here mm -hmm. yeah she was just honestly asking questions i was like and people I mean, were I honestly it happy to answer like, you're, you're yeah. it you're the it like it's just yeah no it's not like she's chasing somebody down answer my question it's like they're they're happy to talk yeah, about that it. name and she just be oh Gay. 
Yes. Yes, I love. She identify as she, she, her. Oh. Like, she. Um, pronouns are he, him, her, and hers. She, her, she, her, her, she, her, 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 yeah, especially yeah. these younger girls, I I felt like they're like, well, we have to like what you were saying, uh, what your kid sees at school. Like, well, we have to be something. We can't be unspecial. We can't just be like a regular straight. God forbid. Right. Yeah, that's interesting. Um, meanwhile, like, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I I don't want to judge these these kids at all. I hope that they find where they're going and get there safely. Really. 